The Sun is a star located at the center of our solar system, around which all the planets, including Earth, orbit. Here's a detailed overview of the Sun. 1. Composition The Sun is primarily composed of hydrogen, about 74%, and helium, about 24% by mass. Other elements, such as oxygen, carbon, neon, and iron, make up the remaining 2%. 2. Structure Core. At the Sun's core, temperatures reach about 15 million degrees Celsius, 27 million degrees Fahrenheit, and pressures are immense. Nuclear fusion reactions occur here, converting hydrogen into helium and releasing vast amounts of energy in the form of light and heat. Radiative zone. Surrounding the core is the radiative zone, where energy generated in the core gradually travels outward through radiation. Photons produced in the core bounce around in this layer, taking thousands to millions of years to reach the surface. Convection zone. Beyond the radiative zone, the convection zone, where energy is transported through the movement of hot plasma ionized gas. This convective motion creates the granular appearance observed on the sun surface. Photosphere. The visible surface of the sun is called the photosphere. It emits light and heat and has an average temperature of about 5,500 degrees Celsius, 9,932 degrees Fahrenheit. Sunspots, cool areas on the photosphere surface, are visible here, chromosphere and corona. Above the photosphere are the chromosphere and corona. To outer layers of the sun's atmosphere, the chromosphere is a thin layer of hot, glowing gas, while the corona is the sun's outermost layer extending millions of kilometers into space and visible during solar eclipses. 3. Energy Production The Sun's energy is primarily generated through nuclear fusion reactions in its core. Hydrogen atoms undergo fusion, combining to form helium atoms, releasing energy in the process. This energy radiates outward, providing light and heat to the solar system. 4. Solar Cycle the Sun undergoes a periodic cycle of magnetic activity as the solar cycle, with an average duration of about 11 years. During this cycle, the number of sunspots, solar flares, and other solar phenomena vary, following a pattern of increasing and decreasing activity. 5. Solar wind. The Sun constantly emits a stream of charged particles, known as the solar wind, into space. This solar wind interacts with the magnetic fields of planets and other celestial bodies, influencing space weather and causing phenomena such as auroras. 6. Importance to life on Earth The Sun is essential for life on Earth, providing warmth, light and energy for photosynthesis. It drives Earth's climate and weather patterns, regulates the seasons and sustains all forms of life on our planet. 7. Solar Variability While the Sun's energy output is relatively stable over short timescales, it does exhibit long-term variations in activity. Periods of increased solar activity, such as solar maximums, can lead to heightened solar flares, coronal mass ejections, and geomagnetic storms. 8. Space Exploration Studying the Sun is crucial for understanding the fundamental processes that govern stars and their evolution. Space missions such as NASA's Parker Solar Probe and ESAS Solar Orbiter are dedicated to studying the Sun up close and uncovering its mysteries. In summary, the Sun is a remarkable celestial body that plays a central role in our solar system and the universe at large. Its structure, energy production, and influence on space weather and Earth's climate make it a subject of fascination and scientific inquiry. If you like this video, please subscribe this channel and press bell icon for more informative videos. Thank you.